Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Manuel Espinosa here, and today I will make a video about the Pistol Six Sauer P365 XL. I will make sure this is empty. Now I will give you a close view of this. This is a 9mm striker fire pistol with polymer frame, really small. You can see the size of this. This is used for concealment carrier most of the time. And about the ergonomics, this is coming with iron side system with nice side on the front and rear, it's opti ready. Also, the slide is coming with serration, front and rear. It's having this extended beaver tail, flat trigger, and the capacity is 12 plus one. However, because I want to stay with magazine restriction, my magazine are 10 round capacity only. So thing that caught my attention about this is how popular it is. I haven't seen a lot of people getting this pistol and they are saying the pistol is great. Also, a lot of people in YouTube are making reviews about this firearm and all of them are saying the pistol is awesome. And today I want to see by myself how good it is. My plan right now is going to be shooting about 250 rounds and see what happens. And at the end I will tell you uh, my opinion, um, how was it? That is pretty much it. This is gonna be most like a running test. Um, something that I wanna let you know about this video, nobody is sponsoring this. I am doing this thing by my own because I like firearms. I like coming here to the ranch, shooting. And also I like to make videos and I wanna share with you my experience shooting this thing. Well guys, I am ready, stay with me and I see you at the end. A little low and a little right. A little low and a little right. 
Well, guys, this is almost the end, and I don't want to continue before saying thank you for watching this video. Now, coming back to the pistol, I will make sure this is empty. It is. I will tell you, I had a great time making the demonstration for this pistol, but there is something that I want to confess. At the beginning, I was not really excited about this firearm because for me, this was like a just another small pistol. I was not expecting too much from this. But when I started shooting, I could realize a lot of good stuff. Um, it's something that caught my attention a lot. One of them is how comfortable it is. When I was shooting, I was feeling really comfortable, especially to the design of the grip and the beaver tail. This was providing me a great support. Also about the ergonomics and the iron size system, because this pistol is really easy to manipulate and also is easy to shoot. At least for me, the iron size system was working really well. And finally, about the trigger. This pistol is having a short reset trigger. We'll show you right now. Look at this. One more time. Right there. You can see a lot of good things in this small pistol. And that is the thing. It's really hard to find a small pistol with all these features together. During this video, I was shooting about 250 rounds and I didn't get any jam, malfunction, anything like that. Basically, this pistol was working, I will say, excellent. It's, from my point of view, and a great option for somebody who, who is looking for a concealment carrier pistol or something like that. About the downside, I only have a couple remarks from my point of view. One of them is about the controls. This pistol is not having ambidextrous controls. This is basically designed for people who is right-handed. If you are left-handed, you will not have access to the controls on this side, and that is going to be a problem because it's going to be uh, really hard to manipulate the pistol on that way. And the another uh, remark is about the price. This pistol is having a price right now in the market of $620. And if you think about it, it's a little expensive for a small pistol like this one. There are another option right now, uh, uh, expensive option. Some of them are $400, $350. But you have to think about the ergonomics of those options because I have been shooting some of those uh, models in the past and I can tell you most of the time with those small pistols I am feeling uncomfortable and it's hard to shoot them but with this one I was feeling right now really comfortable and for me this was more easy to shoot for, from my point of view this is much better than those one but you have to think about your budget. If you have a budget for something like this one, go forward. If not, maybe for you, it's gonna be better option, something uh, with an inexpensive price. However, I don't try to say anything bad about those models of this one. It's just a point of view, okay? It's up to you. But something that I can tell you, this pistol worth every penny. If you are paying that money, the 620, 630, depending on the store or where you are buying this thing, it's worth every penny. So you will not feel regret after buying something like this because this is really, really well made. Yeah, in overall, it's a great pistol. Well, guys, this is all that I got in this video. Thank you very much, and I see you in the next one. Take care.